If you see a word with the letters O-O in it, you better buckle up because you're in for a bumpy ride. There are more than six different pronunciations of the letters O-O, and I'm going to break it down for you as quickly and easily as possible. Let's go. Okay, say the word store and horse. That's the same or sound that you hear in floor, door, and for some people, poor. Other people say poor. Or any word containing those. So flooring or doorway, etc. That's one pronunciation. Now say the word up and bus. That's the same pronunciation that you hear in blood and flood or words containing it like bloody, flooding, flooded, etc. That's the second one. Now say home and rose. This is the same sound that you hear in brooch, which isn't a very common word, and that's the only one that has that pronunciation, so you can basically forget about that one. That's number three. Now say put and could. That's the same vowel sound that you hear in foot, wood, wool, and most words that end in O-O-K, like cook, book, look, etc. That's the fourth one. Now say do and blue. This is what most of the OOs sound like in words like moon, hoop, goof, food, tool, school, etc. Most words have that pronunciation. That's number five. The last one or ones are when it's part of like separate consonants. So cooperate, microorganism, coordinate, zoology, and depending on where you're from, those are all pronounced differently, but that's six and seven. How'd you do? <laughs> Bye.